no, 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 Amy, wait. Uh, I, I know it's not the night you had in mind, but why don't you guys stay and play with us? It'll be fun. It would fun? Yeah, okay, three weeks ago you bought crunchy peanut butter, but now you want the girls to play D and D. Do you have a drug problem? <laughs> What's the big deal? Raj bailed so we could use some extra players. Well, I've just never played Dungeons and Dragons with girls before. Oh, don't worry, sweetie. No one has. <laughs> So, what do you say? I'll leave it up to the dungeon master. A satanic fungus that looks suspiciously like Al Pacino rises from the forest floor and says, you're playing D&D. You're playing D&D. This whole apartment is playing D&D. a drink. Get with that penny. We don't consume alcohol during Dungeons and Dragons. But it impairs our judgment. Oh, this isn't alcohol. It's a magic potion that makes me like you. <laughs> Double potion, please. Oh. Okay, here we go. You find yourselves face to face with two hulking ogres. What are you doing in our dungeon? You shall die. Okay, literal goosebumps, look. What do you do? I draw my broadsword. I ready my quarterstaff. I drink my potion. I see we attack the big one. You know what, give me the dice, I wanna roll. But the dungeon master's supposed to roll. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be in Vegas throwing up on a shrimp buffet, now give it. <laughs> Fifteen or higher. Fifteen's the point. The point is fifteen. Give the little lady some room. Here it is, coming out. <laughs> Sixteen! Oh, ah! ah! uh, please tell me we're playing for money. No, oh, even better than money. You gained experience points. <laughs> More potion, please. Yeah. Uh, Mama, it's a pair of dead ogres. Seventeen, the larger ogre is dead. Ah! The, the other ogre says, you killed my brother. <laughs> now Olga Thanksgiving is ruined. That is amazing. He made me care about the ogre. <laughs> All right, Amy, there's one ogre left. Take him out. Okay. Yeah. Tell so that TSA agent. Come on. <laughs> 19. <laughs> The dragon falls from the sky, crashing into the volcano. Hey! Wait! He's not dead. He crawls out, spreads his wings, and prepares to attack. Get away, get away! Then they say something first. Yeah, you know, maybe in the voice of a beloved celebrity. Fine. You'd think, after all these years. I know not to fly over volcanoes. I'm a freaking idiot. <laughs> and dragons, Christopher Walken, that's perfect. <laughs> All right, Amy, it's your turn. We need one more hit, finish him off. Here we go. 15? It's a hit, the dragon collapses to the ground. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. And says... <laughs> Mother! Is that you? <laughs> Your little boy is coming home. <laughs> oh, I don't know about you guys, but I've been through the emotional ringer tonight. 